the tilapia, tilapia fish. Hello everyone, my name is Christoph Fatone. I'm a student at John C. C. Smith University. I'm a biology major, pre-med in concentration. What we're growing here is uh, vegetables that the community here can use as resources and also um, know how to manage this aquaponic sustainability facility so that we know how to um, cooperate it when we go back to Haiti. I just finished feeding the fish for today and we normally do this two to three times a day. Hello, my name is Shaquana Jackson. I'm currently a junior here at Johnson C. Smith University majoring in biology. Okay, so we have fish over here, which the fish discrete ammonia. The ammonia is converted into nitrite, which then the nitrite is converted into nitrate using a bacteria, um, then which is a useful tool for our uh, plants, which provides um, nutrients as well as help the plants filter to come back to the fish. Hello everybody, my name is Omar Casio. I'm a student at Johnson C. Smith University and I'm double majoring in chemistry and biology. As you can see, everything is in a cycle. From the water, it goes from the fishes to the plants and then goes back to the fishes. So it's a closed circle. And it's also an example of sustainability because we're using very little resources, such as water. We're only using, we're just using 90% less water than would be used outside in a traditional agriculture. Sustainability and the project itself has been a lot of fun, very interesting for me because I really think everybody should focus on what the future holds for us. And sustainability is changing all the time. There's always new ways to improve how sustainable you are as a person, as a household, even as a business. Hello everyone, my name is Johnny Altine. I'm a freshman, uh, major in international business at Johnson C. Smith University. We're going to take the, the, this project to Haiti, this technology to Haiti, where people can feed themselves and they can like use the same technology so we can educate them and they can uh, help the community, the community economically. I am Sandy Mattering. I am from Haiti. I am a freshman at Johnson C. Smith University. I major in biology. What we are looking at is our community garden. So in our community, we produce like radish, radish, lettuce, cabbage, and so on. We recycle water from the aquaponic garden to water our community garden. So when the temperature is lowest, we cover our beds so that to prevent the crops from freezing. Hi everyone, my name is Guzman Sete, I'm from Meidi. I am an international business major and I'm a sophomore. If you go there right now, you probably see uh, people on the street. Uh, people on the street, you'll be, uh, you will see people looking for food. Uh, uh, people lose jobs, they don't have nothing to do. But that's why I'm thinking about the community and as a business major, I can learn something, something I would my major, or fast I can help my country. Me as a Haitian, I'm very proud to be part of this, of this project. First of all, my heart is in there. We do have supporters going in Haiti to support us, but they are not native Haitian. And they, they also, their heart is here to help, but how can they relate to us? I'm here as a Haitian who's, who's here, who understand, and who, who's part of the country, who can relate to the people. I'm very passionate about this project, and I know for sure that it's going to make a better place for my home country. Hi, I'm Dr. Philip Otienaburu. I'm the CGIU liaison at Johnson C. Smith University. Being invited to the CGIU conference is a big deal, not only for the university, but for our students, because they are able to turn their ideas into action. The students have been enjoying every step of the way. Not only uh, do they see 
uh, the actual implications of what they learn in class, but they also turn it into a tangible project that they can see the direct effects of not only in the community surrounding the university, but also in the village in Haiti where they intend to take this project.